everyone, welcome to Ecoholics. In this video, we will be discussing one of the most important term in international economics that is arbitrage. So let's understand what arbitrage means. So the definition says that it is the simultaneous buying and selling of foreign currency in two markets in order to earn profit from the exchange rate difference. So we have two keywords over here. First is to earn profit because of the exchange rate difference. So arbitrage basically means that when there is an exchange rate difference in let's say two markets. So people are going to buy and sell foreign currency in order to earn profit. Now we all know that people buy at low price and they sell at high price. So this is uh, basic economics. So I'll write it over here. So people buy at low price and sell at high price. So what our arbitrages do is, so they purchase foreign currency from that market where price is low and they sell in that market where price is high. So to understand the concept of arbitrage, let's take an example. So uh, example is the exchange rate prevailing in India is $1 is equal to rupees 42. And the exchange rate prevailing in US is $1 is equal to rupees 40. So now, what are people going to do? People are going to buy dollars from US. Why? Because here, $1 worth of goods would just cost rupees 40. So this is just an example to make you understand arbitrage. So by just giving rupees 40, you can buy $1. So people are going to buy dollars. They are going to buy dollars from US and sell dollars in India to earn a profit of so to earn a profit of rupees 2 per dollar. Now why did arbitrage took place in this? Because we see that there is a exchange rate difference between the two markets and therefore we have arbitrage. So wherever there is a exchange rate difference, uh, we have arbitrage in that case because arbitrageurs buy and sell dollars to earn profit. Now, what happens is because the arbitrageurs are going to buy dollars from US market, in this case, our demand for dollars is obviously going to rise. Now, because the demand for dollar rise, therefore, our dollar is going to get appreciated. So here, appreciation of dollar takes place. Now, let's say, now because there is appreciation of dollar, let's say our exchange rate is now $1 is equal to rupees 41. Similarly, here in India, what happens is, because the arbitrageurs are going to sell dollars in this case, our dollar is going to get depreciated. So now, in this case, our dollar is going to get depreciated. Now, because the dollar gets depreciated, now let's say our exchange rate in India becomes 
one dollar is equal to forty one. So what we can conclude is the arbitrage tries to nullify the exchange rate difference that was initially there. So we had exchange rate difference of let's say in India it was one dollar is equal to rupees forty two, and in US it was one dollar is equal to rupees forty. But now when we see that the exchange rate now in US is one dollar is equal to forty one, and in India it is one dollar is equal to forty one. So the exchange rate gets equal. So now because of this buying and selling we see that. the difference in exchange rate gets nullified or the arbitrage equals the exchange rate in two markets so we have seen how the process of arbitrage works i hope you like this video so for more such videos do like and subscribe our channel thank you